So when it comes to constructing major scales on the staff, let's start with C major. And I'm going to write out all the notes of the C major scale. So I've got a C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. And in the case of the C major scale, there's no sharps or flats. So that's done. That's my C major scale. Let's move on to the G major scale. I'm going to do the same thing starting from a G. Go up line space, line space on the staff. Putting eight notes. The eighth is a repeat. G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. But we learned that there is a sharp in this scale, and that sharp goes on F sharp. So although when I write the G major scale with letters, I put the sharp after the letter, when I write it on the staff, I'm going to put the sharp before the note. So this right here is an F sharp. G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G. That's my G major scale. We haven't looked at D major scale yet, but I'm going to show it to you as an example. G major scale has one sharp and D major scale has two. So same thing, I'm going to write out my seven notes plus my one repeat. So I've got D, E, F, G, A, B, C, and then I repeat D. So we retain the one sharp that we had before and that's F sharp. So I write F sharp here after the letter, but on the staff, I'm gonna write it right before the note. And the other sharp that we're gonna be adding in the D major scale is a C sharp. So over here, I've got my C sharp, but I'm gonna write it before the note. So here I've got my D, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, D, and that's gonna maintain our major scale formula, which is whole, whole, half, whole, whole, whole half. And that's constructing major scales on the staff.